5 seconds. Expressing his views on the budget, a member said in the Legislative Assembly, Sir, in my effort to finish my speech as early as possible, I shall first deal with the subject of irrigation in our state. Uh, we have major tanks, minor tanks, tanks maintained by the Public Works Department and tanks maintained by other agencies. But one thing which is common to all these categories of tanks is that they are not maintained properly. Whenever there are good rains, these tanks overflow and cause considerable damage. I think it is time for the government to think about launching a crash program to get all the tanks in the state repaired within a period of one or two years. Even after that, there should be an effective system to carry out the annual repairs regularly with the active cooperation of the local people. I am glad to find that the government have decided to appoint a number of school teachers in the course of the next financial year. The teacher-pupil ratio in our schools is not very encouraging and therefore there is certainly a need for appointing more teachers. However, I want to make a suggestion in this regard. The government now proposes to appoint these teachers on a temporary basis and they will be paid a fixed monthly salary. Of course, I am sure that the government will strive to employ them on a regular basis after some time. If it is so, I request the Honorable Minister to make a categorical assurance on the floor of the house to the effect that all the teachers to be recruited temporarily now will be given permanent employment on a regular scale of pay in the near future. This will instill confidence in their minds and enable them to serve with devotion. While on the subject of education, I want to make a point regarding higher education. There is a general complaint that the results of the competitive examinations for all India services like the Indian Administrative Service clearly show that the number of successful candidates from our state has come down in recent years. Many eminent persons have expressed their dismay over the fact that we are losing to other states the pride of place which we once occupied in this matter. This is happening in spite of the fact that the government is running special coaching centers for the benefit of certain classes of candidates. I request the government to take urgent steps to improve the situation because it will be in the interest of the state if it is adequately represented in the All India Services. Sir, the next point which I want to make is about the suffering of the workers of the textile mills which were closed down in our state some years ago. I am not going into the circumstances which led to the closure of these mills because it is neither necessary nor relevant at the present time. What is urgently needed is an effective solution to the problem. It seems that many of these mills require modernization and replacement of machinery. If they are to be run profitably, I understand that the owners are not in a position to make huge investments for this purpose. But something has to be done in the matter because we should not allow a skilled workforce in a major industry like the textile industry to suffer. I therefore request the government to make some concerted efforts in this regard and see that these mills start functioning very soon. I am happy to note that the government have launched a massive scheme for the construction of houses for those who belong to the scheduled castes and scheduled tribes. A very welcome feature in this scheme is that these houses will be concrete houses with all basic amenities. While welcoming this measure, I wish to make an appeal to the government. I request the government to devise a scheme to provide houses to poor people among the backward classes also. This can be done in a phased manner. This scheme can be implemented in a few districts having a large concentration of backward classes. If for some reason this is not possible, a start may be made by making the most backward classes alone eligible for the benefit of the scheme. Then, in course of time, the scheme can be expanded to cover the other backward classes also. Thank you.